Justin Allegri. Happy Hump Day, everyone, as we hit the halfway point. And the pitch, and Blanco bunts it, and it's a good bunt. Chode has it. He will wing it down the right field line. Here comes Cropper. Inside the show. With everyone standing at Dodger Stadium, Kershaw pitches. Carpenter swings and hits a drive. Right center field. It's in the gap. And it's down off the wall. Inside the show. And now the 1-1 delivery. And here it is. And it's swung on a high drive left center field. Full going back. He's to the track. And he's right to the wall. He's there. To center. Hicks. Going back, and now over, makes the catch on the warning drag. Salvador Perez, the 2-2. Popped up, Sandoval, in foul territory. Inside the show, win. Now on three and two to Utley with Rollins leading from second. Here's the pitch from Beckett. Ball straight three and a no-hitter. Inside the show with Justin Allegri. Happy Hump Day, everyone, as we hit the halfway point of the week. Let's take a look back at Tuesday's news and results. Looking first at the American League East, the Yankees took on the Rangers at the Globe in Arlington, and it was the Yankees who came away with the win. The final was 14 to 4. Pretty boy, Wolverine, was clutch with the bat in his hands, driving in five runs on three hits. He is currently among the AL leaders in batting average. The Yankees starting pitcher, number 56, was once again victorious on the mound, earning an awe-inspiring 20. Put it right at the first baseman, and that's an easy play. Oh, he missed him! How in the world did that happen? Inside the show. 2 1. That is into left field. Cespedes giving chase. Not going to get there. Falls in. Kendrick on his way to third. Cespedes bobbles it. De Sarcina waving Kendrick home. Here's the throw to the plate. Inside the. 0 oh, 2 coming. Swing and a fly ball toward right center into the alley. Bradley on a run. Jackie dies. Oh, he caught it. He laid out and made a sensational play. And again, the 2-2. Popped him up. Foul ground. Avila is under it. And they done it. The Tigers have done it. For the fourth consecutive year, they are champions of the American League Central Division. They lead again for Peralta. Holiday is safe lead at second. Adam swings and hits a drive. Deep right field. Back to the wall. Inside the show, win. With everyone standing at Dodger Stadium, Kershaw pitches. Carpenter swings and hits a drive. Right center field. It's in the gap, and it's down. Inside the show, win. Justin Alex. And the pitch, and Blanco bunts it, and it's a good bunt. Chode has it. He will wing it down the right field line. Here comes Crawford. Inside the show. And now the 1-1 delivery, and here it is, and it's swung on a high drive left center field. Full going back. He's to the track, and he's right to the wall. He's Inside the show. To center. Hicks going back, and now over. Makes the catch on the warning track. Aaron Hicks, 420 feet from home plate. Inside the show with Justin Allegra. Salvador Perez, the 2 2. Popped up. Sandoval. In foul territory. Inside the show. Now on three and two to Utley with Rollins leading from second. Here's the pitch from Beckett. Ball straight three and a no hitter. Inside the show with Justin Allegri. 
Welcome baseball fans to our Wednesday edition of Inside the Show. Let's jump right into Tuesday's action. Starting in the AL East, the New York Yankees were in Arlington, Texas to take on the Rangers. And the Yankees made short work of the opposition. The final was 9-2. Pretty Boy Wolverine was a force at the plate driving in three runs. He currently leads the American League in batting average. The Yankees starting pitcher, number 56, was once again victorious on the mound, earning an awe-inspiring 22nd win of the year. He is currently leading the American MLB The Show has baseball from the Lone Star State as we get a look inside Globe Life Park. Tonight it's game three of this four-game set between the New York Yankees and the Texas Rangers. And before we get on with things here this evening, a look at the two starting lineups we'll see featured tonight. And then briefly, let's take a look at the two starting pitchers who get the assignment here. Pretty boy, Wolverine. We'll dig in, and he's got to be licking his chops as he has absolutely owned this guy in his career. Yelich is running. Now a swing and a hard hit ball to short. And that's a base hit. Around third and being waved on home. And the run will score as the Yankees grab the early 1-0 lead. And apparently they're picking up right where they left off last night. You wondered if maybe they'd want to save some of those runs, but it turns out it might not matter as they hit the board first here again in the first inning. Pretty boy Wolverine will stand in. An RBI double to his credit the first time around. Now the first pitch. Hard hit to third. And a good throw gets him one gone. Pretty boy, Wolverine, will dig in now. One for two to this point. Here's the first offering. Grounded foul toward the coaching box at third. Four runs, five hits, and no errors for the Yankees so far. Now here's the pitch. Oh, one good fastball deserves another as he jumps ahead 0-2 now. And this is a guy who will not get cheated up there, and he almost came out of his shoes on that one. Now here's a ball hit hard on the ground towards short. So a good job of collectively swinging the bats in this one, but if we had to single out one guy who outshined all others, I think it's the man who stands out right here. That is extreme agility by a former football player. That looked like he was heading into the secondary and evaded the free safety. 0-2 oh, coming. Swing and a fly ball toward right center into the alley. Bradley on a run. Jackie dives. Oh, he caught it. He laid out and made a sensational play. Runner tags. He'll advance into third. Jackie Bradley, Superman in the alley. And how about the appreciation from these fans? A spectacular catch. And again, the 2 2. Popped him up. Foul ground. Avila is under it. And they've done it. The Tigers have done it. For the fourth consecutive year, they are champions of the American League Central Division. Big lead again for Peralta. Holiday is safe lead at second. Adam swings and hits a drive. Deep right field. Back to the wall. And it's a gunner. A gunner. A three-run homer for Matt Adams. 3-2 Cardinals in a magical seventh inning. And the pitch is Blanco bunted. And it's a good bunt. Win a game in a very unusual way. MLB The Show has baseball from the Lone Star State as we get a look inside Globe Life Park. Pretty boy, Wolverine, will stand in for the first time, and you can see the average there as he continues to flirt with a 400 season. And this is fouled straight back. Here we go. Hey, double him up. Let's go. Gotta hold him right here. Let's go. Come set. Now the pitch. Hard hit towards center. And that's in there. Base hit. Around third and being waved on home. And the run will score as the Yankees grab the early 1-0 lead. All 
already their second double of the ball game here in the first inning. And he's not fooled too many guys out there to this point, that's for sure. Pretty boy Wolverine will stand in. An RBI double to his credit the first time around. Wolverine. Oh, and a hearty cut there to begin the at-bat. It's nothing in one. And this is a guy who will not get cheated up there, and he almost came out of his shoes on that one. Right over the top with that curveball, and it's 0-2. Now here it comes. Swinging a ball hit on the ground. But this will wind up foul, still 0-2. Now another 0-2. And a good two-strike swing here as he's been fighting off some tough pitches, but the count will remain at 0-2. Ready with another 0-2. And a fastball called strike three, and the side is retired. Pretty boy Wolverine will get things started here in the top of inning number six. Pretty boy. Yeah, and that swung on and fouled straight back. A handful of fine individual performances to choose from in this one, boys. But what do you say we go ahead and let this one And he's right to the wall. He's there. He squeezes it. And the A's have won it. Three consecutive years in the postseason for the Oakland A's. With everyone standing at Dodger Stadium, Inside the show with Justin Electric. To center. Hicks going back. And now over. Makes the catch on the warning track. Inside the show with Justin Allegri. Happy Friday, baseball fans. Before the weekend series get underway, here are the highlights from Thursday's action. Looking first at the American League East. The Yankees took on the Rangers at the Globe in Arlington, and it was the Yanks who came away victorious 6-1. Pretty boy Wolverine was a fantasy owner's dream at the plate with three hits and four RBIs. He is currently among the AL leaders in batting average. Michael Pineda continued his incredible season, earning the victory on the mound his 20th of the year. He is among the AL leaders in wins. Looking at the standings, the Rangers sit in second place in the American League West, 11 games out of first. The White Sox paid visit. Welcome back. I'm Matt Vaskersian here on the MLB pregame show. As we draw closer to the first pitch in this series opener, let's have a look at our tops player spotlight. Pretty boy Wolverine is in that spotlight. As he enters this one, having carried his team offensively last time out, he drove in a bunch of runs and really looked dialed in with runners in scoring position. Pretty boy Wolverine will get his first shot now. He, too, had three knocks in yesterday's win. Here's a bouncing ball now headed for the shortstop, Segura. Throw to first in plenty of time, and his side is retired. Pretty boy Wolverine will stand in now to get us going here in the fourth. Pretty boy Wolverine. On a big swing, and he crushes this ball deep. My goodness, a long home run. A solo shot here to left, and he keeps on going. Number 801 in his incredible career. And the Yankees have drawn even now at one apiece. Up next for the Yankees. Pretty boy Wolverine will get another shot. He homered his last time. Now here's the first pitch. Grounded foul. 